Mark Twain Cigar Box Guitar, take one. <coughs> Greetings friends and fellow Cigar Box Guitar enthusiasts. Del Puckett here and I just finished up this Mark Twain three string cigar box guitar. I got the strings on and they are stretching and they are tuned to the key of C. How do I know they're the key of C? Well, because I used my C harmonica to tune it. Anyhow, so this guitar is handcrafted in Portland, Oregon. And I do have another blender knob on here. And if you've been watching my most recent videos, you know that this blender knob blends the single coil along with the embedded piezo, the piezo that's embedded underneath the saddle here. And um, this one here works really well. Oh my gosh. So right off the bat, I have um, the strings tuned C, G, C. And this is the 30 wound, 22 wound, and 14 plain steel. This is a 23 inch scale fretboard. So right off the bat, if it's on zero, nothing. Just acoustic. And the box amp is on. If I go to one, the piezo comes alive. If I go to two, I start I start getting the a little bit of the single coil in there. Three, even more hear the single coil being introduced. Four, it's almost equal. And you can tell the single coil's in there because... So on five, it's exactly half. Six, it's going to be more single coil and less, maybe like a 60 40 mix. Seven, it's almost entirely single coil. off. So it's off all the way on and off all the way back. So it goes from zero piezo and as I go across it goes more single coil to 50-50 and then as I go past five it's going to go more single coil, less piezo, more single coil all the way to off again. So cool. So if you put it in the middle, you get both.
right, so that's it for this Mark Twain three-string cigar box guitar. A couple of things I wanted to point out before I sign off here. And one of them is, look at this string catch here. So I put the eyelets, and then I just put a nail, and then strung the strings, ball ends through the nail, through the eyelet. So I have eyelet there, eyelet here, holding on the jute strap. And then also the eyelets down here. So I have seven eyelets on this thing here. So you heard of four eyes. This one here is seven eyes. So that's it. Oh yeah, last one thing I wanted to point out is notice the diversity here on the, the bushings to the tuners. I have gold, black, and silver. And even on the screws on the back, I have, um, what do you call it here? Diversity, absolutely. So, oh yeah, and there is also a uh, veneer on the top of the headstock. You can actually see it right there. And that is just a cutout from one of the ends, pa uh, panels on the inside of a cigar box. And I'm not really sure what kind of wood that is for the fretboard, but it's dark in comparison to the, to the light wood here, so I thought that was kind of cool. I did, I did stain it aged gray. You can't really tell. I wanted it to match the box. It's kind of, kind of matches. Same thing with the, uh, the saddle there. It is also aged gray. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. And don't forget, there is a PayPal donate button in the upper right hand corner of my YouTube channel. If you'd like me to build you a three-string cigar box guitar, be sure to get a hold of me at the email provided in the video description. I will see you in the next video.